Wait, what was this, Jay? What's that building? This is uh, the first uh, Confederate White House that we at right now. In Montgomery, Alabama. Montgomery, Alabama. The birthplace of the civil movement in the United States. Do I sound like a historian? Do I sound like a Montgomery historian? I don't think so, because no? I think it's civil I think rights. I'm give you a tour. I think it's a civil rights oh, movement. Civil rights. What, did I say? what did I say? Civil movement. Civil movement. Civil rights movement. This is the West Wing, West Wing right here. This is the West Wing. Um, and over there is the East Wing, established in 1808. Nah, I don't. <laughs> I'm, I'm making that little shit up now. <laughs> this is your greenhouse. <laughs> That's what I want. Should we go in and show? So we visit some. Uh, this is the highway department in 1963. Uh, the governor at the time was George C. Wallace. Now, do you know who George C. Wallace is? I have no idea. Do you remember when the National Guard, the president had to send the National Guard to Alabama? Because um, they were ending segregation and George Wallace didn't want that to end. He didn't <laughs> want to end segregation. There you go, history lesson. History lesson. 1963. 1963. This is the South Union, South Union Street. 11 South Union Street. Uh, this is no, but no. This is the Capitol. Oh, right this here. this is the State House. This this right here is a Capitol. Mhm. Mm we're gonna see these flags real quick. So if this is a Capitol building, huh. oh, that yeah. means one thing. Montgomery is the capital of Alabama. Gotta be. What about uh, we Jay crossing? No, hold on a second. The first Confederate White House is on 44 Washington Avenue. So what is that building right over there? I don't know what that is. Let's go over there. Let's go. Let's go over there. Let's. Nope. I believe it's that one over there. Look, we got GPS. Can't see it. Is that that corner building over there? I don't think so. This is the Alabama I think State this, House. It's this one right here. Look, that's the Alabama State House. Mm hmm. This is the controversial. Is that the controversial? No, they changed it. Didn't they? The Alabama flag? Or was the Georgia flag that was at the. Uh, was the Georgia flag? The Confederate flag? Yeah. Confederate? I don't uh, They changed it? I, I don't know they did. Well, that was a whole South. I don't think that was just, that was a war flag. I don't think that was a state flag. No, but one of the states had it. As a flag? Yeah. No, oh, that's, that's mad far. Because we're in a 700 block. And the first white, the first Confederate White House is 444. See if you see it. Oh, let's cross. We don't want to try. We try not to J cross. Like you did. <laughs> I ain't even. Ten minutes ago, in front of the police department. Israel tried to jaywalk. No, Israel jaywalked in front of the police department. He really wants to go to jail in Alabama. That is it. Look, the first White House. And and, and Jay followed. <laughs> So where well, you going? Well, they don't call me Jay for anything. Like, <laughs> they walk. They walk. This is the first White House of the Confederacy. Jesus, it's so Designed big. Designed an exec an executive residence by the provis Provisional Confederate Congress, February 21st of 1864. President Jefferson Davis and his family lived here until the Confederate capital moved to Richmond, summer of 1861. Built by William Syrie, 1832 to 1835 at Bibb and Lee Streets. Moved at the present location by the First White House Association and dedicated June 1921. So, the First White House. Look at the flag. That doesn't look like the Confederate flag. Oh, wow. Look going. Well, well, we have reading it through the, they, the we, we read it through the fence. That's not the Confederate flag. 
how, how many stars it has. Uh, seven? Yes. Yeah, I guess the seven uh, seven states that was Confederate. Let's see if the door is open. Let's see if they let us in. Let's right, say it's open. No, we won't touch it. This is wrong. I don't worry, we fall through the wood. It's open. It's open. Check it, check it, check it. Good morning. Welcome to the first of a whole series of Confederate Executive Mansions. Okay. The uh uh Jeffrey. I'm just gonna be a few minutes. It's a okay. self-guided tour. Okay. I'm just okay. gonna give a um, up in New York, we call it a shtick. <laughs> down here, I guess they'd call it a spiel. But anyway, the, uh, this is the first of a series of Confederate executive mansions. You've got the Confederate government uh, here for almost four months. Uh, Davis will, Jefferson Davis here, the president, will get inaugurated over on the front steps of the Capitol. Okay. It also happens to be the same place where 104 years later, Dr. King gives his voting rights speech. It's almost the same exact place, so wow. it's kind of interesting, you know. That the, oh. uh, but the um, Davis will be, he'll come, and of course you got to have a place to live, so the first White House. Now the term White House doesn't get used until 1900, long after the American Civil War, yeah. but it's kind of a short-handled term. Mm -hmm. First Confederate executive mansion is kind of a whole lot to say. Just mm -hmm. or what locals here in the government like to just call the little White House, <laughs> the little White House. But Davis will be here for about four months. The Confederate delegation next door is going to vote 24-20 in May to move the government up to Richmond. You can go to Richmond and and um, tour the home there, the old Brockenbro Mansion in in Richmond. That's where the government. And Davis will be for 40 years. Davis, of course, comes from over in Mississippi, mm -hmm. past U UX, United States Senator of Mississippi. He and the family live in this house, and the house has many Davis items in it. Um, everything wow. is authentic from the period. Probably about 30% of the items are Davis's. There's another percentage of items that were in the house when Davis moved into it. Well, it had been a house that was built to really conduct and entertain cotton brokers. It really, um, there's not a government uh, use really for the house before that. It's built in the 1830s, mm -hmm. and uh, I think you'll both enjoy it. Mm -hmm. And uh, there's a self guide over here that will go along with all the bronze plaques outside, oh, okay. outside the rooms. Yeah. Sweet. Yeah, so oh. you just kind of walk through. Admission right. is free. Mm -hmm. Can I get you two? And, uh, just enjoy. I'll probably be back there. Okay. Um, uh -huh. I'm scrubbing up some old Civil War bullets. But uh, oh man, that's awesome. <laughs> uh, All right. Would Would you guys like one? Yes. Yes. They're, they're from yes. right here. I mean, oh they're, yeah. They're, they're from General Wilson. Oh, yeah. Let me let me get you one. Wow. Let me go get that and get the water. Oh, right. Thank you. Thank you. Guys you. Just walk, enjoy. Thank uh, you. Much appreciated. Yeah. You're welcome. So this is wow. uh, Jefferson Davis. Yeah. This is, happens to be Jefferson <laughs> Davis' bedroom. Now this is. You don't have a king size bed. He did it. Yeah, 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 yeah. You don't have a king size bed. That's canopy. And it was pretty high. Little canopy. Yeah, little yeah, little steps, yeah, little steps. Yeah, little steps. He must have had a oh, chihuahua. Look at the books and everything. Look at the the. This is cool, man. This is cool, man. This is. I like cool. how we just got to read it. Huh? Yeah, I did. Al Alabama. Um, people are here. All 